Hi guys, Chris here from Matt for Tech. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to see something on the home automation front. We are going to unbox and review a Bluetooth controlled LED bulbs. We have here is a magic blue LED bulb. I've got a B22 base type. This is what I need for my house at this moment. But let's go ahead and see how this device works and operates. There is not much to unbox here. The bulb comes in a simple and well presented box with a plastic film. The packaging of the bulb is quite simple with a see through plastic on the front. And there are some descriptions about how to use on the sides. And there are also some features on the remaining two sides. Opening the box, we have the bulb itself in a plastic clay. This is the B22 base type. We have other base type also available for the same model. This is actually an LED bulb and it is not dimmable. On its side, we also find a card with a QR code for the app which supports both Android and iOS. I have bought this from gearbest.com. The links for the same are available below in the video description. There are also many more similar products available in the same website. Plug the bulb into your holder and off you go. It also needs a companion app which you can download from the Play Store using the QR code. Opening the app, we could see the bulb automatically listed as a new device. Press to add the device, it will prompt you to rename it. I am going to name it Bulb1. We are going to create also a group which can have maximum of 5 bulbs and these can be controlled together. There is also independent power on and off switch for each of the bulbs in the group. Here, I am going to create a group called living room to control all the Bluetooth enabled bulbs in my living room. And I am also going to add this device to the group. As said before, it also allows you to control the whole group in a single toggle. We can long press on the bulb icon and go into a detailed menu. There are multiple options. Let's see one by them what are the options we have in the application. The first screen contains option to choose the color of the light. By moving the cursor, we can change the light's color. We can also create presets and use them for future. But we can create only a maximum of 5 presets. In the next screen, we can define the warmness of the light from the bulb. For any colored lighting, the warmness tend to go towards black and we can change it or increase the warmness to make it more of an yellowish light. There are also presets for black and yellow light. In the next screen, we have various application defined presets from the app itself. These presets allows the light to change gradually between various colors in an interval or change the brightness of the same color over a time period. There is a time interval slider at the bottom which helps us control the duration between the change of lights. These effects can also be used to create some smoothing ambience in your room. Next up, we have an equalizer function which makes the light change color and brightness based on the music we play from our device. This is more of a dance floor or a party effect. There are various equalizer presets available including a user defined one in the section. Choosing the music from your device and playing it creates an ambience where the light is flashed with increase and decrease in brightness with color changes based on the music played and this is according to the equalizer highs and lows. We can do the same thing in the next screen but by capturing any sound by the microphone of the phone we are controlling it. Put it near a speaker or another device of the music it plays it brings the same effect. In the last screen, we can use our camera to capture the color of any object that we are looking at and turn it into light. 
we can also use this in an automatic and a manual mode for picking the colors. This can be used to create effects for photos and videos. Finally, we have a clock symbol on the top right hand corner. Touching it takes it to a mode where we can create a scheduled power on and off. This could be handy if you are going to use this as a night lamp in a kids room which needs to turn off automatically after 10 pm in the night. The connection between the bulb and the device is via the Bluetooth and there were no poor connections. I was able to turn it on and off from my other room and even sometimes from my parking lot which is not a far distance away. The device could distance out at 10 to 15 meters. This seems okay. I did have some difficulties if there were any metal objects in between. As in bulb, it never had any issues. The bulb is stated to have an output of 4.5 watt with 350 luminance of brightness and it meant to run for 50,000 hours as it is stated by the vendor. There are no deal breakers as such, but limitations. For instance, we cannot use more than one device to control the light, only one at a time. And also, we need to be within the specific distance to control the light, like at home, we cannot do it from work. But I am nitpicking here, since these are more of limitations than complaints. So what's the verdict? This is a very good product. I would recommend it to anyone. If we need a different base or a more powerful LED, we can do so. There are many more similar products available in Gearbest website and the links to which are available in the video description. Anyway, this is me. Do let me know your thoughts and your questions via the comment section or hit me up on Twitter at Madfotech. As always, if you had liked this video, do leave a thumbs up and be subscribed for more videos like this. Good day, take care, bye bye.